Lord, we thank you once again, Father God. We thank you, Father God, for giving us the chance to be together again with you. Thank you for this gathering. Thank you for your love. Thank you for giving us the chance to worship you once more. Lord, 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 Lord. in spite of all these tragedies, crisis through this pandemic, dear Lord God, still, you will strengthen our heart. You have strengthened our soul to face the challenge, to face the changes that have happened in this world. Lord, in spite of all the tragedies, dear Lord God, in spite of all the sickness, in spite of all the deaths, from frontliners, from ordinary people, and from brothers and sisters in the community who have suffered the same fate in dying through this pandemic. Lord, despite the world that's, that has closed all doors, dear Lord God, for our Savior, for our life to be saved, dear Lord God, His doors of hope, His doors of chances to be with you again, dear Lord God. You have opened up all these doors once again for us. And through this change, dear Lord God, we have re learned to reflect on ourselves, of who we are truly to you. We've learned how to see our inner self, our character, our attitudes, the way we deal with our brothers and sisters, the way we deal with our neighbors as well. All these things, all these things, Father God, all these experiences that we have gone through, the Lord God, you have changed everything, the Lord God. As if this pandemic has been a blessing in disguise, the Lord God, for us all. For through our hearts, through our minds, we learn that in your eyes, beyond the heavens, you look upon us as little beings, the Lord God. We are so small to you, the Lord God, up there. And that's why the Lord God we claim we truly believe as our lives being small we truly believe that you up there the Lord God are the only one large in our eyes lines are large in our minds for truly you are larger than life